Hello, wonderful world of YouTube, it's Alex. And today, I am in Peninsula, Ohio, standing next to Tiger Valley Scenic Railroad tracks with a train on it. Tiger Valley Scenic Railroad has history dating back to 1880, when the tracks were built and the first trains ran. And it was owned by the Baltimore and Ohio Railroad. And it ran this way until 1980, when the tracks were eventually sold to the National Park. During that time, between 1880 and 1980, the tracks saw a lot of freight use, passenger use, with different types of trains running up and down. 1972, when the Chicago Valley Scenic Line was formed to run on those tracks as a scenic train. And from 1972 until the 90s, the railroad would run under the name Chicago Valley Scenic Line. We ran different types of trains and different engines, including two steam engines at one point. However, in the 1990s, the railroad rebranded into Chicago Valley Scenic Railroad, which it still runs as today. The railroad runs a lot of antique equipment, including several Alco locomotives, some vintage dome cars from the California Zephyr, and most importantly, the best part of all, really friendly staff. The railroad is still here today. The ticket cost for a coach ticket is $20, but they also have the neatest service available, the biker board, hiker board, or kayak board service, also known as the Explorer program. For $5, you can get a one-way ticket from any station to any station. It's actually pretty neat. You can load your bicycle up on the train in the baggage car, or your kayak, or if you're a hiker, you just simply board the coach car and pay the $5 to be on the car. Overall, the scenic railroad provides a lot of neat service for the local population, seeing the sights and sounds of the national park, and also providing ways for people to travel around. Overall, it's a neat little thing to see, and I'll see you guys next time.